Hello, welcome to a brief tutorial on how to create a watcher or compliance notification role. This role will be used for an individual or user to get a notification on um, an approval of a compliance form. So whoever is logged in as an admin at their site can come in and assign that, that role to someone. So if they go to the left under your tools and down to settings, um, and then click on notifications. When you come into notifications, you'll see any notifications um, or watcher roles that have been set up for your site. And if we want to add a new one, then we can click add notifications and we can add a new notification. So we would simply put in the email address of the person that needs to be notified um, of that update. And then for notification type, we'll click on this and we will select compliance forms. Here you can get notified of all submissions for every compliance form that's been set up for the district. Or you can click on the drop down and you can select specific forms for that notification for that user. Um, so you can do one form and then you can add an additional one if they need to have multi, but not all of them. And of course, you can trash can any of these as well if you want to get rid of them. And so once you've um, created what submissions they would like to receive a notification for, you'll click the create button. So now this person is going to get an email that they will have to go in and confirm. And um, when this, when you add someone for these notifications, um, these for these notifications, they will receive notifications for their unit and anything below them. So if a watcher or notification role is set up at the district, then they would get notified for those specific forms at the district and then anything that's under the district level in the hierarchy. So if it's at the school level that someone is set up, they would get a notification for that specific form, anything at the school or the SSO of under them. If it's an SSO that sets up the notification, then they would only get notified at the SSO level because there's nothing up under them in that district hierarchy. So now we can see that we've added that notification um, and we would go and check our email. So we would have an email here that we need to click on here to confirm that, sub, um, that subscription. And then you'll get a message that it's been confirmed. So now that person should receive notifications for those compliance documents that they were signed up for. Once you have your notifications set up, um, then you can come to the three little dots and you can edit the notification or you can unsubscribe the person. Thanks so much for listening and joining today.